The next thing we want to work on is a hollow position, right? So th in this position, we're going to try and get round here, round here, and even roundness across the whole body. Go ahead and stand up for a second. Stand up. Face that way. Arms up. Get round in here. We want an even roundness. We want to get rid of anything resembling an arch in that lower back. Right? We want to get even roundness all the way through. We don't want a pike in the hips. We want one line going all the way from the hands to the feet with an even amount of hollow. All right? Lay down your back. This translates into a position that we call a candlestick. Move you back up this way a little bit. There you go. Arms back, feet up. Candlestick, there we go. We're going to get to this position where we're going to try and hold that same hollow position. And this becomes very important for release skills. Every single swing, when you're releasing in a swing that comes forward like this, every single swing has to fin finish in this position to be technically correct. If you have something going out this way, well, you're going to have a lot of troubles finishing at the bar where you want to be. right? So I'm going to move you up a little bit more. So the most important thing here and the most difficult thing to coach, turn your hands that way, that way, there you go, is that when you're coming up in this position and you're trying to maintain this body line and you've got to push back and open up your shoulders, it's a difficult thing to maintain. That's a really nice. I don't know if you guys saw. That was beautiful. That, that really nice even round position is really difficult to maintain as you come up and have to push back in your shoulders. I'll watch it one more time. There was a little, just a little bit of release in the chest on that. Not much, but that little bit is something we got to get rid of. Because if it's happening here, I can guarantee you that in the middle of a really dynamic, powerful swing and release off the bar, it's magnified enormously. That little bit turns into a big arch with your feet going the wrong way and your stomach leading the skill. 